In the red, it is Bulgaria in the blue at stake, a world championship, the gold medal final bout of the night. Artur Alexanian, three-time Olympic medalist, looking for his fourth, fourth world championship. His first since 2017, Kirill Mielhoff standing in his way, the 2020 Olympian, trying to build off some momentum from the Olympic Games and now win possibly his first world championship. A lot of risk control here. Alex Simon always has the control over the wrist if he can. They've been called vice clamps throughout the years. When he gets those things on your wrist, you don't clear it. Oh, exactly. Referee always wanting the wrestlers to have the head up. That shows that you're being more aggressive, more active, head down. Tends to lead the negative wrestling, a little bit more passive. So quick warning given to Mielhoff. Alex Onion almost looks bigger from when I last saw him at Olympic Games. Early point given to Alexanian and a 1 0 lead with the passivity. So, with his performance yesterday, Alexanian now has guaranteed himself to be a six time world medalist. And here comes the wrench that so many fear. And that's why. So powerful, so powerful. Trying to come back the other way with it. A couple of turns and he goes up 5 nothing. Neil Hoff in some trouble. Alex Sanyan trying to get one more. He's going to say, nope, I'll be content with that. Yeah. But he does it so fast and so explosive. One rolling, uh, Mueller, he was almost not on the stomach again, then he starts again on the other side. Milov is trying to, to stay active. Attention. No single blue. 15 seconds to go here in this opening period. Alexanian able to get the early passivity point, get to his bread and butter, which is Parterre. Two quick turns on Mielhoff and a pretty good three minute body of work. A five nothing lead for Artur Alexanian. Now we were talking about countries and Greco Roman wrestling. Armenia, one that is always consistently sending two, three finalists every year yeah, in this yeah. style. They're a very strong uh, Greek Roman wrestling nation. Getting cooled off. Both corners. Mielhoff trying to find out a way to get something started positive. It's been all red so far through the first three minutes. Yeah, now we have to set the set the page. Control the center. Let's see if there's a renewed urgency from Mielhoff to start this period. I always bring the fight. Jumps on briefly for the two-on-one. 
Alex Sanyin clears it away. He was trying to pounce on the right arm. Again, tugging at the left shoulder this time, and he's doing enough action to generate the call and the point. So Milov with a chance to get back in it. 33 seconds in. That was fast. Sanyan takes the position and can Mielhoff return the favor. And it grips it above the belly button. He'll slowly start to slide down. Now he has him somewhat up into the air, but he never really had a clean grip on it. And Alex Zanyan. Gets back to his feet. So we saw a good parterre defense for our young wrestlers out there. Yeah. Kids learning the sport. Two keys to good parterre defense. Great movement and flexible hips. Always control the hips. Core of the body. Yeah. Sport. Revolves around the hip area, whether it's offensively or defensively. Alexandian had good hips on that last exchange. That's why he still leads by four, did not give up any points. Besides the passivity, Mielhoff going to have to try to get something on the feet, which has been tough to do this week against Alexandian. He won a low scoring bout, three to one over Saravi. Of Iran in the semifinals. Did not give up any offensive points as far as off the feet in the qualifying round. So he is known for what he can do offensively up top, but he is certainly a tough one to score on. Just eating up a little bit of the clock. Really yeah, exactly. Not Every position he gets into now, he just hold on to yep. it. If it's a wrist, if it's arm, um, just hold on to it. No real intention to try to score off it, but he knows that clock is going to be dwindling down and there's nothing Mielhoff can do. Yeah. Right back on it again. Exactly. Just keep Mielhoff from getting to his attacks, and that's what he is doing very effectively. Ten seconds remaining. It has been five long years. If you would ask Artur Alexanian his last time that he raised his arm as a world champion, but he has got it done here in 2022. In Serbia, he is now a four-time world champion. He joins an elite group. Amazing wrestling, yes. You're winner.